What is up YouTube, XDG here, back with another video on the GTAX channel. Today I'm going to show you guys how to make this cool air racing jersey merch outfit. There's quite a few steps to make this outfit, but I'm going to try to be as quick as possible. I'll also try to make this tutorial beginner friendly. And with all that being said, let's get it popping. So the requirements for this glitch are on screen right now, so make sure you have everything you need before you begin. For step one, make sure your USB flash drive is plugged into your console. Then you want to go ahead and transfer one of your save files to your flash drive. Hit the PSN home button, go to settings, application save data management, save data in system storage and copy to USB storage device. Select Grand Theft Auto. And for the purposes of this tutorial, we'll be using this save right here. You also want to look out for backup saves. Don't transfer those saves to your USB. You want original saves. So we will go ahead and transfer this to our USB. From here, let's take it to our PC. On your PC, you're going to make sure your USB flash drive is plugged in. You want to start up the Save Wizard software and we're going to go ahead and double click on Grand Theft Auto and right click on our save file. For me, I know it's right here. So we're going to right click and select the advanced mode. At this point, once the advanced mode is open, you want to go ahead and start up GTA Save Editor. Once your save editor is open, hit open file. And you're going to import the file found in the description or you can use your own birdskip save file. From here, we're going to hit the little shirt icon right here, which opens our actor editor. The outfit you want to bring online is in shortlist actor one. So we're just going to actually review those components. On main, you want to make sure it's multiplayer female, free moto one and beach bums. For the mask, make sure you have the penguin mask. Skin hands is blank. For legs, you will have the purple joggers. Shoes are blank. Tarso one is also blank. We're not going to use any armor or logos. And for Tarso two, you need the mustard cropped biker. This is the texture we're going to use to flip our orange jersey and turn it to purple. And finally guys, make sure you have the green bulletproof helmet. Once again, a link to the decrypted data file will be found in the description. Go ahead and close the actor editor window and hit save. Close that out. And you already went ahead and prepped Save Wizards Advanced Mode. So all you need to do right now is import that decrypted data. As you can see right here, the apply button is grayed out. So what you want to do is take your mouse and left click on the zero right here, and then go ahead and hit zero on your keypad. Let's close that out. And now the apply button becomes active. So just go ahead, select that and hit yes. Accept here and let's go back to our console. Back on our console, make sure your USB drive is inserted. So we're going to go ahead and hit save data on USB storage and copy to system storage. Go to Grand Theft Auto and select our save file and hit copy. Hit your PSN home button and start Grand Theft Auto 5. All right, guys, so you should spawn in with Franklin here every single time. Just go ahead and start an invite only session. As we spawn online, our goal here is to make two modded outfits, which we will merge using the BEF method. Our first outfit will be the Save Wizard outfit and we'll merge the IAA badge and the racing suit right here. So you want to go ahead and get the CNT racing suit and you're going to save it in slot one. From here, equip your outfit with the IAA badge and head over to the time trial. Let's see if I get killed running the girls to the ball game. Just redrive here, brother. I think I'm gonna get smacked. I'm gonna get smacked. I know it. I can feel it. I can feel it. Oh. Oh. Actually made it, chief. All right, all we need to do right here is go ahead, start the time trial and head back to story mode via the options menu or the character wheel. So as you go into the clouds, you should spawn as Michael. He will make a call to Lester. When Lester picks up, he will say, ha ha. You immediately want to hit the options button, hit left on your D-pad, select Rockstar Editor and go into director mode.
In director mode, we'll merge our IAA badges by going to Actors, Online, hitting Circle to go back twice, go to our shortlist Actors, and as you can see, the IAA badge will merge directly onto the outfit. Go ahead and walk out of the trailer. Outside the trailer, you want to wait around for about 30 seconds, and then you're going to hit your interaction menu and quit director mode. At this point, you should be in story mode with the modded outfit and you want to go ahead and ready up your playlist job with criminal records or there's this option right here. I recently found this out. You hit the PSN home button, go down to the right. And if you have a Grand Theft Auto event right here, you can also use this instead of using your playlist. All right. So if you're one of those players whose recent activities are not showing up, you can go ahead and use this option right here. I'll go ahead and demonstrate right now. We're going to go ahead and hit the options button, go to online and start an invite only session. Now, as soon as we get into the clouds, we're going to hit our PSN button and start that recent activity. And it will have the same effect. You will get this alert. You just want to go ahead and hit OK. And once in story mode, all you need to do is hit your PSN home button and close and restart the application. Once you get into story mode, all you need to do is go ahead and start an invite only session. All right, so as we spawn online, you can see we have our modded outfit. Go ahead and start up Crooked Cop so we can merge our air racing suit to this outfit. Confirm your settings and invite your friend or someone from the lobby. All right, so on this screen right here, you're going to go down to own outfit. Our air racing jersey is in slot one, so we're going to hit right once on our D-pad, then go back once. And as you can see, the air racing suit has merged to our outfit. Go ahead and ready up. Right here, you want to pull up your interaction menu, go to style, accessories, and we're going to use a pair of glasses today to save our outfit and simply leave the job using your phone. All right, so at this point, you should spawn back online with the merged outfit. I'm just gonna go ahead and take off the glasses right here and head to the clothing store to save the outfit. We have the base components for our first outfit. Next up is the second outfit, which is the adversary mode racing jersey outfit. You will need at least one racing jersey to complete the outfit. A link should pop up right now, which will show you how to get your adversary mode racing jersey. Go ahead and watch that and come right back here. Yay! Alright guys, so welcome back. At this point, we should have two outfits. On our outfit one here, we need to replace the green bulletproof helmet with the biker helmet that corresponds to purple. And on outfit number two, we actually have to transfer our green bulletproof to this outfit. So we are right next to the telescope. You already know the vibe. You're going to go ahead and equip outfit one and transfer this bulletproof helmet to outfit number two. All right, so once we successfully transfer the green bulletproof to our racing jersey outfit, let's head back to the clothing store. All right, so back in the clothing store, the first order of business is saving this outfit right here. So I'm actually going to go ahead and delete this number two and literally replace it. All right, so right now you should have these two outfits right here. So let's go ahead and select outfit one and put on that biker helmet that will correspond to purple and will give us the purple bulletproof helmet. And that is actually the orange fiber dome. All right. So once you've switched the helmet, so go ahead and once again and delete and overwrite. We're going to go ahead and equip outfit two. So we're going to go to style, accessories, gloves. And we need the gray 
digital tactical make sure you have those gloves and next we need uh pants to make sure our texture remains the same we're going to go to suit pants and we're going to get the purple suit all right so this will ensure that our purple joggers remain purple let's go ahead and save this outfit all right guys so we are finally ready to go into the beth method once we complete that method we should have the full outfit i'm not going to go through the entire thing right now but a link will pop up to show you guys that are brand new to this how to do the beth method this is how you're really going to get your customized rear outfits there's a lot that can be done with this method anyway guys the final thing we have to do right now is go ahead and get our gloves so we're going to use the racing jersey and uh, we need the poison motocross we're going to get that and save it in slot one Anyway guys, I know I have been doing a lot of female outfits lately. I will be doing a few male outfits from here on in. Thank you so much for watching. Hope this video helped. Don't forget to drop a like and subscribe if you're new. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out.